Hi, it's Madison, and today we are going to be making Tangled Inspired Lanterns. The materials you are going to need for this craft are two different colors of construction paper. I used yellow and purple, and then you're going to need a marker and some craft glue. Our first step in this craft is to decorate our first piece of paper. So as you can see, what I'm doing here is I'm kind of mimicking the sun, which is a symbol in the Tangled movie. So you can either copy the design that I'm doing, or you can feel free to decorate it any way you want to. Um, you don't have to copy what I'm doing. This is just an example of one of the many things you do, but you can decorate your paper however you want. You can add uh, hearts, stars, as you can see that I do kind of near the end. And it's definitely up to you. You can maybe use stickers, different colors of markers, anything you guys want. Once you finish your design, you're going to take your paper and roll it into a cylinder. As you can see, what I'm doing here is I'm just mapping out how tight I want to make uh, the cylinder and that's where I'm going to glue it. So you're going to take some craft glue and just put it on, the, on one edge of your paper and then eventually you're going to roll it up and stick both ends together so it forms a cylinder shape. So once we set that aside to dry, we're going to take our second piece of construction paper and fold it horizontally so the bottom edge meets the top edge. And then you're going to take some scissors and just make cuts um, in the middle of the paper. And then you can see what I'm doing is I'm kind of measuring the outermost layer around the design that we just created. And I found that the cuts weren't long enough so I cut more to the top edge of the paper and then I just mapped out where I wanted to place my outermost layer onto the design that we created so you'll see I'm just mapping out where I'm going to glue it and then once I figure out where I want to position it I'm just going to take it off and then take some craft glue and glue along the edges uh, each edge of the paper, so the top and sides. And then I just took our design that we created and rolled it up into the outermost layer and made sure I was happy where with where it was positioned and then I was done. And this was the final product. I hope you guys enjoyed this one.